Hello interwebs, how are you doing? I am doing well today. I wanted to make a quick video to tell you that Overwatch Beta has officially been announced. October 27th is the first day of closed beta in the Americas region and I'm super excited. I really hope I get into the first wave of beta, even though I'm so emotionally torn because October 27th is the launch day for Halo 5 and why I like get competitive marketing, I do, but then in the same sense, why do you make me make these choices, Blizzard? Why do you do this to me? So if I don't, if I don't get in the beta, I'll be playing Halo 5. If I do get in the beta, I'll be having a lot of hard life choices in front of me, but that's okay. Um, anyways, I was going to make a video today. Um, I put up a poll on my social media type things and asked you guys what you wanted to see. And I think that WoW Jokes number four was the winner, followed by Warcraft Negativity. So in the next two weeks, those two videos will be live. I was originally going to make that video today, but then they announced Overwatch. And what was I supposed to do in that situation? I know. I uh, no, I can't wait for Overwatch. I'm super, super excited about it. If you uh, haven't seen it, I actually made a video recently that was like the top 11 things you must know about Overwatch before playing it. So if you did not see that video and you want to see that video, I'll have it linked on the screen, I guess, linked in the info below. It'll be links. There'll be links. Check it out. Um, I'm really, really excited for it, and I just wanted to check in, let you know the beta date in case you haven't seen it. And are you guys excited? I'm so excited. Are you going to play Halo 5 or are you going to play Overwatch? Like, if you get an Overwatch beta key... Are you going to play Halo 5 on launch day or are you going to play Overwatch? And I know it's probably a question that some people don't want me to ask, but I'm serious. It's really hard when companies do this, when they launch two, when two big games are launched on the same day and you're left with that feeling of like, ah, oh, decisions, decisions. Um, also, this is unrelated to what I was just talking about, but did you guys see the patch notes for patch 6.2.3? I'm super excited. I'll talk more about it in my next World of Warcraft video, but the moose is not a storm out. Super excited about that. I mean, we all thought the moose was a storm mount. It was in the data as a storm mount. And instead, it's going to be like when you kill heroic or mythic Archimond, you'll get this fragment and you have to bring the fragment to like Moonglade to prove to the druids that you are on their side and that you murdered Archimond. And they're like, oh, I'm so glad you murdered Archimond. Have this moose. Yes, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm so much more excited for it now because I was I was gonna buy it. Like, let don't get it twisted. I was gonna buy the moose, but it's way more exciting that it's tied to an achievement because that's one of the coolest mounts that I've ever seen, and it's tied to an achievement. And there's another new mount being added for a uh, cataclysm time walking. Really excited to see they're doing more with time walking. I hope that that eventually expands to raids. Um, they are also adding a couple extra to Wrath of the Lich King and Burning Crusade. The Burning Crusade one is Magic Terrace, so that's pretty darn exciting. And then there were just like a couple other things, like arena seasons and stuff, but I'm sorry guys, I just, I don't PvP, so I have a really hard time just like talking about it from an educated standpoint, but they are updating Mythic Dungeons, so the gear is really good, and then on top of that, they also added Valor Points back into the game, or they will be adding Valor Points back into the game, and you will be able to upgrade your gear 10 eye levels, kind of like in Mist the Pandaria. So, um, basically, that's all just a giant nerf to Heroic and Mythic Hellfire Citadel, but that's okay. We're nearing the end of the expansion. Honestly, nerfs are a good sign. Nerfs mean that the end is soon to come. And it's not that I didn't enjoy Warlords of Draenor, because I actually really liked the raids in Warlords of Draenor. I didn't hate garrisons, unlike most of the population. Um, there was a lot that I did like about this expansion, but I'm just so excited for Legion. I'm so excited for artifact weapons. I am so excited for demon hunters. I'm so excited for the return of Dalaran and like this whole new continent area and the new, for the first raid that's coming out, the seven boss raid, looks super cool. I'm just... I'm pumped. I am hype. I am the conductor of the hype train. Choo choo, mother effer. So that's about all I had to say. I just wanted to check in, tell you about Overwatch, have a little discussion about Overwatch and Halo, because I'm real excited about Halo. And I wanted, I guess I said all the things I wanted to say. I will have a real video coming up. I'm sorry that I keep doing these weird vlog things on this channel. It's just, I don't, I don't have an excuse. Deal with it. Did you guys notice the quality is way better? The first time I uploaded a, like, test video with my new camera, I <laughs> I rendered it out in, like, 27 frames per second, and it had this weird, like, Gaussian blur on it. So I fixed that. It should be super HD. Ah. And um, so that's exciting. And anyways, I'm going to go. I hope that you guys are having a wonderful day, and I will see you soon. I'll have some new episodes of Derpcraft coming up. I also have, of course, the Wowhead Weekly podcast on Friday. And then 
Downtime Tuesday will be like Monday night, Tuesday morning as usual. So, and then next week I will have like a big New York Comic Con video, which I'm super excited about. I'm just waiting on um, this awesome guy who does like videography and stuff like that for Mega Blocks, and he's letting me use some of his B-roll footage because I am a huge idiot. I took like 45 minutes of video, which is kind of a lot of video, at um, New York Comic Con. None of it is B-roll. <laughs> so I, uh, <coughs> first day with my new... <coughs> mouth pieces anyways um so i'm waiting for him to send me some stuff which was super generous of him and then i'll have a new york comic-con video next week i'll have downtime tuesday next week and then i will also have um either wow jokes or warcraft negativity i'm also still very much in talks about getting back into doing league videos um i'm just i would like to have a fan site to do it and so i'm just kind of waiting to talk to some people and see where we're going from there and I'm really excited. I just feel like a lot of good things are to come. And I'm glad that you guys are going to be on this journey with me. And I think I've said enough, so I'm going to go. I hope you're having a wonderful day. And I hope that you are super excited for Overwatch or Halo or whatever it is that you're excited for. I'm going to go. I love you all. You're in my heart. I'll see you soon. Goodbye. How cool is this? My phone is also, it's like a, well, I have a viewfinder above the camera. But then my phone also serves as a viewfinder. And it's the button. So watch. I'm going to go now. Bye. Bye.